right. So you you grabbed me to show something new. Yeah. On the Bella stand. Yes. Just yesterday we released an update to the Gliss firmware, which is here. Just yesterday. Just yesterday. Yeah. yeah. Uh, fresh, hot. And the biggest update is that Gliss is now available in a 1U format. Okay, that's so going to make a lot of people it's available, very happy. You can buy it as a module in 1U, but if you already own a Gliss, you can update your module with our very handy web updater. It takes about 10 seconds. And you can buy just this as a, as a faceplate. So you can make a Gliss 1U out of a Gliss you already oh, own. Oh, that's clever. Or if you want to buy a whole Gliss 1U, you can do that too. But this is a free upgrade available for all current Gliss owners, and it's shipping with all new modules going forward. And it also has a bunch of new features. So we have the usual um, control mode, and here I'm controlling the pitch of this system. And we also have our good old record mode. Here I'm using the record mode as being triggered, and I'm using that to control the envelope. And down here, this is one of our new, new features, is in control mode, we have customizable slew rates. So for example, here I'm adding some reverb, and you can see when I raise the voltage or I lower it, you can see that orange dot that's following it, that's the slew. So it, you can customize the attack and release of your touches, and you don't need a, an external envelope module to do that for you anymore. You can use one if you want, but you can also set that right within Gliss. And that customizable slew can be anywhere from zero to 100 seconds, so either really short or really, really long for long evolving ramps. And how do we get to program that in? Oh, well, you go into the menu by holding down the button and tapping twice, and it's a whole new selector in control mode is down here. And now you've got four, four selectors. This is the top output attack, top output release, bottom output attack, and bottom output release. Got you. And you slide this around. Now, we know that not everybody's going to want a 100 second attack or release. So oh, the do. first 40% of the touch strip is 0 to 1 second. The next 40% is 1 to 10 seconds. And the final 20% is the extreme range where you can set a slew uh, attack or release to uh, 10 to 100 seconds. So you can customize each one. Really easy to do. You can do it on the fly. You can edit it as you're performing if you really want. And as you can see, that now the, the, it doesn't just jump to the voltage when you touch anymore, it climbs according to your customized rate of attack and release. Got you. Is there a cheat sheet available so we can get to learn all these things? Well, if you go to bella.io meet Gliss, there's a link to our manual. And that is a very extensive manual. And right at the bottom, if you scroll right to the bottom of the page, there's a printable cheats, cheat sheet. You can print it out double-sided, fold it as a little pamphlet, and you can have it right beside your rack. That's cool. So just to summarize, new yep. form factor and new firmware all released yesterday. Yes, and there's a bunch of new features. It's just one, the new attack and release. We've got about five or six new features, so come check it out. And if you have a Gliss already, you can upgrade to this new firmware for free. Many, many thanks. Thanks. <laughs>